everybody, we're Keenum handicapping thoroughbred racing on Friday afternoon, April the 6th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle East Coast Racing Report. Let's go to the Big A Aqueduct first for Race 8, the feature on their card this afternoon, 3.46 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Patsy Prospect Stakes, a mile test on the dirt, three-year-olds race for $75,000. Contenders number one, Sports Writer, number three, Zetter Home, number four, Coalition, and number five, Quiet Favorite. Number one, Sports Writer, the overall speed leader in his stakes field, racing at the mile distance on the dirt, has hit the board in power run fashion at three straight, winning twice in this recent streak of racing consistency. Jockey Cornelio Velasquez and trainer Rudy Rodriguez send him to the post. They've hit the board with 54% of more than 100 entries saddled as a team to date. Number three, Zetterl Holm, the pace profile leader in this field, racing at today's distance from a mile on the dirt, has hit the board in three straight, winning his last two adventures, including a power run win his last time out. Race 8 summary, number one, Sports Rider, tops my contenders list today, which also includes number three, Zetter Holm, number four, Coalition, and number five, Quiet Favorite, one, three, four, five, and the eighth from Aqueduct, the $75,000 Patsy Prospect Stakes. Let's go to Keeneland next for race 9, 5.13 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Transylvania Stakes, 8.5 row on route test on the turf, grade 3. Three-year-olds racing for $100,000. Contenders number 6, Silver Max. Number 1, State of Play. Number 5, Monastic. And number 7, Icon Ike. Number six, Silver Max, is the only entry in this stakes field not taking a step up in class this afternoon is both the overall speed and pace profile leader. Racing at or about today's distance of eight and a half furlongs on the turf has hit the board in power run fashion in four of his last five, including a pair of power run wins being embedded in this recent streak of racing consistency. Number one, State of Play, has won three of his last five, including a power run win his last time out. Race nine, Summary. Number six, Silver Max, tops the contenders list today, which also includes number one, State of Play, number five, Monastic, and number seven, Icon Ike. That's 6157 in the ninth today from Keeneland, the $100,000 grade three, Transylvania Stakes. Let's go to Pimlico next for race nine, 455 p.m. Eastern Post time, five and a half for a long sprint on the dirt track, three year rolls and up race for a claiming prize of $24,500. Contenders number six, whatever it takes. Number one, Dancing Roman. Number three, Christmas Flies. And number five, Peace Addiction. Number six, whatever it takes, qualifies as the Trackmaster Plus Power Pony as the speed and pace profile leader in his field. Sprinting at or about today's distance of five and a half furlongs on the dirt. Has hit the board in power run fashion in four of his last five, including a power run win his last time out. Number one, Dancing Roman has hit the board in four of his last five outings overall, including back-to-back -back power run wins in his last two starts. Jockey Javier Santiago and trainer Hugh McMahon sent him to the post this afternoon. They fit the board with an impressive 68% of their last 50 starts as a team together, with equally impressive 36% win rate, producing a positive 38% return on investment in the process. Race 9 summary, number 6, whatever it takes, tops the contenders list, which also includes number 1, Dancing Roman, number 3, Christmas Flies, and number 5, Peace Addiction 6135, in the ninth today from Pimlico. Go to Gulfstream Park in Florida next for race 6, 3, 35 p.m. Eastern Post Time. Mile test on the dirt, 4-year-olds and up race for a claiming prize at $20,000. $500. Contenders number eight, Sting Boy. Number four, Mize the Big Cat. Number five, Dixie Band. And number seven, Zuber. Number eight, Sting Boy has won five of nine in his career to date, sprinting at today's distance of a mile on the dirt. Takes a class drop of 11 units. Both the overall speed and pace profile leader in his claiming field, racing at today's distance of a mile on the dirt. Has produced a quartet of power runs in his last five, including back to back circle trips in his third and fourth races back. Number four, Mize, the big cat, the morning line favorite, has hit the board in three of his last four, including a power run win in his third race back. Race six summary, number eight, Sting Boy, tops the contenders list, which also includes number four, Mize, the big cat, number five, Dixie Band, and number seven, Zuber, eight, four, five, seven, in the sixth today from Gulfstream Park. 
bonus long shots turf paradise race three to six the one shot number six white spar the overall speed leader in this climbing field sprinting at five and a half furlongs on the dirt mountaineer park race six entry number seven just made four to one in the morning line takes a 7-eleven track master class drop as nice speed for this six for a long sprint so handicapping for both aqueduct keeneland Pimlico and Gulfstream Park on a Friday. Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.